Created musical history. We wow. did, I know. Together in the wild would live. Just another bring day in the life. Underwear. <laughs> what? Here we are, Kyle. Mm. Pleasure hanging out with you. Kyle Shot, right. ladies and gentlemen, from the band The Sword. And we have a whole heck of a lot of his glorious signature model guitars. Brand new instrument from our friends at Reverend. And uh, we did a couple different videos, kind of overview. You and Ken Haas were talking. We did. And uh, talking about the specifics of the guitar. And then we However, talked. However. Yes. However, you. This video is for this specific guitar. Right on. Yeah. Right on. That's what we do here at the Wild Woods. We talk about the kind of the overview, and then we get down and dirty with the individ. Yeah. Is individ a really a, a shortening for that word? It is I now. Think, I don't think it is. Well, it is now. And you know what's weird is that every video we do, it's like your favorite serial number. I know, but it's because I forget that my favorite number is actually the one until the it one comes. until it comes the one until it comes the one my, my the favorite end. number happens to be two six three nine eight which is the serial number of, of this, this fantastic guitar right here particular weapon that's exactly correct and you know what we just found out there's going to be an added feature to these particular guitars is that you're actually going to sign these guitars. i'm going to sign the back of each headstock that's right because i'm that kind of guy you're that kind of fella. <laughs> and this guitar has a weight of 7.34 pounds. We were talking that these are light instruments. They are. It's for people that uh, just have a lot of shoulder pain. <laughs> like and you were, you were discussing that you played some guitars in the past that were a little pestilential in the weight frontier and gave you some bone spurring. Yeah, when I was younger, I thought that the guitar had to be as heavy as possible. I didn't think that it was the tone that had to be heavy. I thought it was really the... <laughs> yeah, well, you know, guitar. you live and learn. You live and learn. 33 is a, a lot different than 23. Exactly. You know, and... Um, so we designed this. Some people, when they're bad young, boy. they snort a lot of laundry detergent and think that's a good thing. And then when they get older, they're like, that's not cool. That was really bad, but you, sinuses are cleaner than ever. Exactly, you know? and that's important. <laughs> Rocky Mountain High! Let's talk about this three-tone sunburst. Show them what it does, I, Greg. I dig this color that you got going on here. I, at first, I thought, when I first got the Alpine burst, it, I thought that was my favorite. But then once I got my hands on the three-tone burst, I just love the natural wood grain. It looks Coming magnificent. Through there, I think it's so pretty. Larger body for the larger fella. It's a maple top on a Karina body. Chambered in there. A wider center block than the average manta ray. Yes. And for the controls, we got two master volumes. We've got the bass contour, and we've got a master tone control. Yes, sir. So that we could end this is your signature pickup back Yeah, we here. put my signature pickups in there. Uh, I, I tried to mimic the, the humbucker in the bridge, single coil in the neck, uh, kind of that, aesthetic is what yes. I like, but it is, uh, it is double coiled under there just to eliminate some hum, but uh, it's super creamy like a B90 would be. Let's hear that neck pickup clean. We can really hear the quasi hollow body nature of this mm -hmm. guitar. It's okay. got a lot of that sweet, sweet articulation. So that, the bass contour all the way down. Yeah. It's all nice and spanky. Then you want some girth. That sounds good. Let's Thanks go to that for making it sound good. Man. Well, my, it. it's easy to do. These are fantastic. <laughs> Sounds magnifico. What I like about these Reverend guitars, including this bold weapon, is the amount of tones that are available with just your grubby little finger. Very versatile, not a one trick pony at all. Absolutely. Well done. Thanks. Kyle in the house, what? And of course, these uh, inlays are indicative of your, uh, your quest for aquatic excellence. Yes, I, I find that uh, I have more fun underwater than I, I do on top of the water, usually. Yes. Uh, so yeah, and, and it was based off the manta ray body style, and I actually do scuba dive with manta rays, so I thought it'd be fun to put the diver down uh, 
sort of flag as my inlays. I can dig it. There, yeah. I can dig it. Ladies and gentlemen, this particular guitar is 26398, which is our favorite serial number of all time. I know, they just keep cranking them out. And uh, it's going to be signed by Kyle. So check it out here at Wobble Guitars. I'm Gregory Cockery. We'll see you later. <laughs>